During a serious medical ailment, there may be a point in which curing the medical condition is no longer possible or the patient chooses to not undergo any more treatment. Hospice is designed for this situation. Hospice care focuses on the care, comfort, and quality of life for a person with a terminal illness whose doctor believes he or she has six months or less to live if the illness runs its natural course. A hospice team usually includes nurses, doctors, social workers, spiritual advisors, and trained volunteers. Everyone works together with the patient, caregiver, and or family to provide the needed support. Hospice is an approach to care. It is not tied to a specific place. It can be offered in the home or in a medical facility such as a nursing home, hospital, or hospice center. Before deciding to enter hospice care, please thoroughly talk with medical staff and your insurance company about what services will and will not be covered while on hospice. Most hospice plans do not allow a person to receive life-extending medical intervention. This may include using a ventilator and or IV nutrition called TPN. If a person is dependent on these treatments, entering hospice may end access to these services. A family shared with me a loved one had a serious, life-ending medical condition. Their loved one had a tracheostomy tube and needed a ventilator to breathe. The family talked with the hospice care team about entering hospice. Their loved one met the criteria and was accepted into a hospice facility. After conversing with the medical staff, the family left for the day. The family was not informed that having a tracheostomy tube and using a ventilator is considered life-extending medical intervention. Once the family signed care over to the hospice center, they gave the medical staff the ability to disconnect their family member from his ventilator. As soon as the family exited the building, medical staff turned off the patient's ventilator. Four minutes later, the person died. When the family learned of this egregious act, they were devastated and enraged. They wanted me to share their story with you. Please, before entering hospice, know and understand what services will and will not be continued. You may be giving medical personnel the right to kill you. Thank you so much for joining me. Please remember to like and subscribe down below. I hope you have a great day and a wonderful week. Bye-bye.